All right, folks, how's it going? So today I'm going to show you how to simplify design using Photoshop so you can screen print with one color on a T-shirt. So today I'm going to use Dragon Ball Z as an example. So I'm just going to type Dragon Ball Z in Google, then go to images. And what I like to do to make things just a little bit easier for me, after I'm in images and I type in what I want, I'm going to go into my tools and then make sure the size is on large so you can get a higher resolution and then drop the color to transparent. And the transparent eliminates your background, okay? So now I'm just going to pick an image. Let's see something. Here we go. So we're going to do Super Saiyan God. Save this to the desktop. Now we're in Photoshop. We're going to go to File, New. And then we're going to drop down right here where it says Document Type and go to US Paper. Because you need to have a resolution of at least 300 DPI. So dots per inch. This is just the easiest way to do it, just to go to US Paper and it'll default to it for you. Let's name it. I'm going to name it T-shirt, DBZ, and then hit OK. So now we have this to work with. Now the image we just saved to the desktop, we're going to just click on it and drag and drop it in here. I'm going to go ahead and while it's in there, I'm going to resize it. So it's already going to be selected for you to be resized after you drag and drop it. So just hold shift on your keyboard and drag from one of the corners. And what shift will do is make sure it adjusts uniformly as opposed to like this. All right. Now that it's adjusted, we're going to click the arrow over here on the toolbox and hit place. And now we can drag it. And I like to get my nice and centered. The line should automatically pop up right there in the middle. If you can see the purple line and it's going to pop up across. So you get a vertical and a horizontal creating a cross showing your image completely centered. Now that we're centered, this image is actually still considered just an object. So we need to convert it to a raster. So a raster means we can edit it. You'll move over to a layer, right click on it and hit rasterize layer. Now it's rasterized for you. Now the easiest way I found to simplify an image is you go into with that layer selected, you go into image adjustments and then posterize and you will get a, a bar here to adjust the levels. I always drop it down to the lowest level. Have it drop down to two. And hit OK. From there, we're going to go to Image again, Adjust, and Threshold. Now, the threshold, I usually don't have to mess with this too much. You can do so if you like, like this, to get what you want in there. So you can adjust the threshold back and forth. Adjust the threshold to 75. Adjust yours according to your image, whatever looks best to you by moving that slider, and hit OK. OK. Now you have an image that's ready for your for a t-shirt. And now that that's ready, we're going to go ahead and file, save as. I'm going to drop it down to JPEG. And that's going to be your print format. It's going to show you what size. I just always keep it on on the maximum setting. It usually starts off with just uh just high, I believe it is. And my but mine's always defaulted to like the maximum. So okay, for the highest resolution. And then I'm going to go ahead and save the PSD as well. So that stuff, so you can go back and edit it. All right, folks, thanks for watching. I hope this helps somebody out. Please, if you have any questions, put them in the comments below. And every file I make, whenever I make a video, it will be available for you to download in a link in the description. So I'm going to include the Photoshop file, which is a PSD. I'm going to include the JPEG if you want to just print it straight out. And I'll include the original image as well. All right, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.